Hey guys. Um, I'm having to hold my phone because I don't, I'm in a different car. I have had an eventful last three weeks. So bear with me. I know I look like shit. Um, I just got off from work, overslept this morning. So I had to just jump in a quick shower. Didn't get to do my hair. So it looks like crap. But anyway, I'm in a different car because my car got hit and it's not drivable at the moment. I didn't get hurt, everything was fine. Um, but it is in the process of getting fixed. So I am driving a temporary replacement, which it is awesome, I can't complain. It is a 2020 Toyota Corolla. It's amazing, gets good gas mileage. But yeah, I'm really, really liking it. But anyway, I got off from work at 12 o'clock, so I thought I would go to Elizabethtown, which is about 30 miles from my home, and thought I would do inside the dressing room at Target. I had to go to Target to get a few things, so I thought I would look at some uh, office wear, because I can wear office clothes now at my job, and uh, also wear scrubs. I'm not sure if they have scrubs at Target or not, but we may look at them as well and see what we can find, see if there's anything that I can't live without. So, we will see you. Whoops, I'm not going the right spot. I can't talk and drive at the same time. Yeah, because I can't, I'm not multitasking too well today. And for those of you who sent me messages about my mom, I want to thank you so much. It was well appreciated. It helped me get through the bad days and uh, yeah, um, it's still trying at times. I, I miss her. God awful do I miss her. But we're not going to cry today. So, I will see you when we get inside of Target. This first item is a blouse. It's in a size 2X and I absolutely loved it. I love the V and the little pleat in it. It has pockets on both sides. I love how it's the U shape on the sides. I think that slims you. In the back of it, the material was a stretchy like material and you could wear it as a long sleeve or a short sleeve. I wished it was a little bit longer in the front, but it didn't mind me. I didn't hate it for that, but I absolutely loved it. It'll be great to wear to work. Then I tried it with these slacks and I got them in a size 18 and they do zip on the side, but I was able to just pull them up over my belly. But I didn't like the length of them and how they kind of flared out. I thought they were kind of short. So, but I like the pattern of them with the stripes. I thought it was super cute. It, or no, I think it was checks, like little checks. It's hard to tell. I should have got up a little bit closer. But those I didn't purchase, but they were in a size 18. Then I tried on these jeans, and they are in an 18 as well. The pockets in the front wasn't real, but the pockets in the back were. And they were jeggings, and they were super stretchy. I didn't like the length on them either. They were a little short, and I'm 5'4 for reference. But they were bigger around the waist, which I liked, and they tapered down. So I think maybe if I would have got them in a long and a size 16, I would have liked them a lot, lot better. But they were $24.99. For that, they wasn't worth, yeah, I would have had to have sized down. This next item was on the clearance rack, and I thought it was amazing. But it had so much static in it, I thought it'd be cute as a dress. But then when I put it on, I seen it was a little bit too short to be a dress. So I paired it with these leggings. But I like how it's got the V-neck and it's wide. And it was super, super soft. Amazingly soft. So this one I did purchase. And it was in a 3X. These are actually maternity leggings. For those of you who are apple shaped, that is an option. If you're bigger around the waist and thinner in the legs, maternity wear is a great 
option. It fits extremely well. It comes up over your belly and it's still tight to your legs, but they weren't tight enough around the ankles. Then I tried this just t-shirt material in a 1X, extremely too small, but if it was only $6 and something, it was on sale. So it would have been cute if I would have got it in a bigger size, which I was aiming to, but I completely forgot. Then I paired it with these bag pants, I guess that's what you call them, where they look like paper bags and they had the little tie and the pockets and I love the pattern on the legs. Super cute and they were very, very comfortable. And these I got in the straight size and extra, extra large. I wish now that I would have purchased them. They would have been super cute to wear to work in the office where I work now but I didn't, I didn't get them. And they were so soft and comfortable. And then I just paired it with this cardigan, which was super cute. It, I believe, was in a 1X and it was soft and I loved the colors. The pants had this color in it as well, so I thought it looked super cute together. But I needed to size up, I think, in everything that I had tried on. But other than that, it was, Okay, so I'm home now and sitting in my utility room and something you guys don't know about me is I smoke and yeah, I know I need to quit. It's a bad habit and it's something I try to hide from you guys, but if you're going to be my best friends, I'm not going to hide anything anymore. Anyway, I bought two of the things that I tried on and then I bought a long cream colored cardigan that comes down close to your ankles. It's like a sweater material and I got it for uh, $8 and something I think it was or it was 12 8 or 12 But with that and with all the makeup that I bought, I'll show you guys in a minute what so I'll... I bought the black blouse and I like because the back of it is this really soft stretchy material and then the front is that not so stretchy material and it's Ava and Viv and I got it for seven dollars and 48 cents and it's a 2x then I bought this as well it had so much static in it when I was trying it on and it's in a 2x and I got it for $13.98 and it's in a 3X, 24, 26. But yeah, I thought I'd wear it with a pair of my black leggings. So couldn't beat that. And then what I didn't show you all was this cardigan. Let me try it on and show you guys. What so like. this is what it looks like. It's in a 3X. It's the only one they had. And it's got a stain where somebody had stepped on it down there at the bottom. But I absolutely love because it's long. It kind of looks like a house coat though, don't it? But I like it anyway. I thought I'd wear it with a mini skirt and some high boots that comes up past the knee. Don't mind the messy bedroom. But yeah, I like it. I wished it wasn't so big right in here. And the sleeves are extra long, which I like. And that's rolled up. But yeah, I think it's cute. I think it'll be cute with an outfit. And this is my outfit of the day. It's a jean skirt dress. And I have a cream colored tank top underneath it because my boobs are so big. It gap, gas, gaps there. And then I wore it with my brown boots to match the little tie belt. But yeah, that was my outfit of the day. Then I'm going to show you the makeup that I bought. I run out of my Infallible Pro Glow. Well, actually, I didn't run out of it. It just got bad because I didn't use it. And I wanted to try some that was good because I love this stuff. I got number 206 this time. My other was 207, and I think that was a little bit too dark. So I tried this one. Then I picked up the Hydrating Face Primer, Prime on the Go, with from e.l.f. I don't know if it's new or not, but I wanted to try it, the hydrating, because my face is a little dry in the winter time, so I wanted to try that. And then e.l.f. had some new camo concealer, 
And this is the Hydrating Camo Concealer. I wanted to try that and see how it works. I love the regular camo concealer. It is amazing. Then they come out with these little pods. Four eyeshadows in them. And they're only $3. And I got truffles. I think it's so cute. I'm going to try this tomorrow. See how it looks on the eyes. I love it. And then last but not least, I picked me up another Wet n Wild. I use this for the top lid eyeliner. And it's Wet n Wild. Super cheap. It's black. 875B. And I think it's amazing to be so cheap. I think it's absolutely amazing. And that is my video with Target. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell below. And give me a thumbs up and share this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Love you bunches. Bye.